Hello and welcome to a brand new episode of Go Williams Lake, only on Shaw TV. Now it seems as though every time I walk into the SPCA, I always want to come out with a new pet. So today I decided to visit the Eagle View Equestrian Centre. I mean, my landlord's going to be okay with a horse, right? <laughs> Now, before we get too caught up, let's introduce our first story. Remember last episode I showed you a sneak peek of Peter's jam session? Well, did you know that Peter is not only a musician, but him and his wife Gail actually make cigar box guitars from scratch? <laughs> For over 40 years, Peter Thorne has made various music while stroking the familiar strings of his guitar. But it wasn't until recently that the musically talented artist discovered he could be more than just a guitar player. A good friend of mine uh, she suggested checking out the bookstore in town, that there's a book on, knowing that I was involved in woodwork and music, I checked it out and it was, there was cigar box guitars and I thought, well that's kind of interesting. I remember being a kid, my grandfather gave me one and I tried making one and I split the wood and I just tossed it and I gave up the idea, I thought it was crazy. And then I saw it and I looked at it in a different way and I thought, well that's kind of cool, well I'll give it a try, I'm not doing much right now anyway and I want to get back into woodwork so. One thing led to another and uh, now I'm building them and it's growing. I, I've seen the growth even in the past year and a half in Canada now. Peter channeled his skills inward by combining his passion for music along with his woodworking skill to create his own unique cigar box guitars. While the guitar hero's decades worth of woodworking has allowed him to make these guitars completely from scratch, he still continues to face some challenges. Face and still face, it's probably the uh, fingerboard, the fret spacing. You want to be as absolute as you possibly can. There's very little room for error there. Otherwise, you'll, you'll be stuck with the out of tune instrument. You'll never be able to tune it or play it in key, yeah. Despite the difficulties, Peter found a unique way to add more value to his handmade guitars. The fact that Gail's an artist and combining the two, um, that just makes it more original. Any creative people out there, it's amazing what they come up with. And the art just seemed to fit. It was, uh, it makes it unique. It, it's one of a kind. In fact, when Peter first thought of the brilliant idea, he was glad him and his wife could perfectly harmonize their skills while strumming to their own beat. He's got a combination of his cabinet work with his guitars, because he's an excellent guitarist too. So the two of them marry together perfectly, and then it just makes sense to put, and then he doesn't know how to draw. I mean, he, he thinks he knows how to draw, but it's not quite the same thing. But I, so I said, well, you know, I could easily paint on those guitars. And so we started to play with it and everything, and we figured it out. It's, it's the way in which I feel fulfilled. I get satisfaction from, producing something that nobody else could produce. The guitar lover attributes his new success to the years of guitar playing he has under his belt. I have to say I'm lucky in the fact that I can combine woodworking skills along with uh, playing guitar, stringed instruments, combine those two together and basically that's all I've ever done in my life and it's just the perfect thing for me, I've always often wondered, what could I build that would be a neat thing that other people would be interested in? This happens to be it, and uh, I was, I'm lucky that way, yeah. Each guitar made by the Thorn couple are one of a kind. For Go Williams Lake, I'm Christina Jam. Now, if you're interested in purchasing a guitar or learning more about the talented Thorn couple, visit their website. Yeah, well,